Nemesis is back. Bigger, wilder, bolder, and also a lot weirder. But the question is, if Adidas has improved this enough for it to be a considerable upgrade on the first really innovative Nemesis, or if it's more of the same, only it just looks way more spacey. Adidas say that while Nemesis keeps its core DNA, this is a complete overhaul. It introduces a new tension tape upper construction made to adapt completely to the shape of your foot and a new stiffer split out sole to give you more rapid changes of direction. All of it to make the Nemesis 19 Plus a weapon, beautiful and agile football. That also means that the only proper way to test it was to take it to a pitch so beautiful that the grass is always greener on the other side. The first experience with the Nemesis here is a fun one with the by far smallest opening I've ever seen on a football boot. But actually, it works out pretty well because with the stretch of the tape, the boot opens up just enough for your foot to get in and then proceeds to wrap your ankle closely, leaving no extra gaps, giving you a much more personal and one-to-one -one sensation that you got with previous generations, which is something I enjoyed quite a lot. And it also makes this one of the best high-cut executions I've ever tried in terms of fit. The Nemesis 19 party is invitation only, but your foot is on the guest list if you have a shoe on. The rest of the fit is decent. We're talking a reasonably wide boot where you really feel the inner tape band tightening around your foot to try and lock it down. It does an okay job, but you'd also need to get used to the tightness. Although it isn't as unpleasant in the midfoot as it was on the Nemesis 18 Plus. The toe box here is covered in a thin layer of silicone, meaning that this part of the boot isn't as soft and stretchy as the rest of the tension tape, but it's comfortable enough for you to feel at home. But you're gonna feel tightly wrapped in though, so consider going up half a size because the Nemesis 19 Plus is super tight. Going upside down, Nemesis 19 Plus reveals the torsion system, which has been set into the world to give you a stiffer, more responsive experience. The split out sole does absolutely nothing to change the performance for better or worse, but the stiff insole board gives you a very solid, stable and potent feeling when you're pushing off. And the rounded studs, that are slightly longer and grip well, while they do their jobs, it's not revolutionary, but it works very well. The fun starts when you touch the ball. Nemesis is engineered to be unrivaled and with a clean touch and solid grip, there's no messing about. Because since the upper is made with tape on the outside and a thin mesh on the inside, it is extremely thin, meaning that you feel everything on the ball, no matter where on your foot you touch it, and that's an awesome feeling when you want to dribble. And combine that with a pretty low toe box and you get a very honest feel when you shoot, where the boot doesn't get in the way, no matter which kind of magic you decide to do. At least, kind of. Because while Nemesis 19 Plus impresses in some areas, reality has caught up with it in others. I was a wee bit annoyed about the stiffness of the upper, where it took longer to break in and soften up than I would have liked to, especially compared to Nemesis 18 Plus. And then I have a few concerns about the band on the inside trying to give lockdown to your foot, because it simply puts too much pressure in one spot to be truly comfortable. And if the lockdown was mind-blowingly amazing, I'd probably be willing to make the sacrifice, but it isn't, and Nemesis 18 Plus had better lockdown. So I would be a little bit hesitant to jump out of my X or my Copa and into this, unless I'm really into hardcore barefoot like dribbling. The Nemesis 19 Plus is a well performing boot that looks really cool on feet, no doubt. But is it special enough? Or has the success, innovation, and boldness of the first model become its own Nemesis? 
Of course, if you like the new Nemesis boots, you can buy them exclusively from our store already if you click the link right over there. But before you do that, go tell me what you actually think about them in the comment section right down below. What you should also do, of course, is to go subscribe to our channel with the notifications on by clicking the green bubble right over there. And after that, go learn some sick skills that you can do with your new Nemesis if you click the playlist right down there. With that said, guys, I'm signing off. Cheerio.